everyone welcome back to my channel i am filming another video today i know that's a bit odd but me and my friend were just having a little whatsapp chat um it was oh she's re text me um we were just having a little whatsapp chat and um she was giving me suggestions for my new videos um so i decided um why don't you tell me what you would like me to do for my channel and she said a bathroom haul sort of thing so um like a bathroom collective haul so i've got everything i use in the morning and some of it i use at night like i don't use deodorant and perfume in the morning but um some of the stuff that i use in the morning and at night to put in this video and i'm going to show it to you i've got um, some stuff on a tray and some stuff in a little goodie bag so um without further ado i'm just going to get started into the video otherwise this is going to be so long and i don't want the video to take forever to upload um so i'm going to start off with the wash bag this wash bag is from radox i got it for my mum as a present but i'm still looking for one of my own wash bags so i just borrowed this one for now um the first thing that I pick out of this pouch, which I use every single morning, and um, you would have seen this in my previous video, is my perfume. This is the So Love Me um, perfume. I absolutely love it. It's from Conquers All So. Um, it just has um, such a fruity, fresh, florally smell. It's quite musky as well. Um, and I really, really like this. I love my perfumes, but this one is definitely my favourite by far so i'm loving that one um the next thing i've got is my eye makeup remover because i wear mascara and eyeshadow and liner and stuff and i do my eyebrows so i don't and um, because your eyes the most sensitive part of the skin on your face it's not good to use a face wash on it so i just got a sensitive um eye makeup remover which i use with a hot cloth i would usually have a hot cloth and a body puff here but they are soggy and all wet and dripping in the bathroom so i can't really bring that in here um i've also lost the lid of this so oops okay anyway um next thing is this i love spice cinnamon body wash it's only travel size i wasn't i wouldn't normally use this one but it's because it's travel size because we are just away for a few days um absolutely adore the smell of this it sort of smells like gingerbread but i don't know why i think that because it's meant to smell like cinnamon but it's quite sweet very festive but i really really like it it's gorgeous the next thing I have, which is pretty obvious, is some hair grips um, because I do my hair in the morning and um, I've, I also have hair bands, but they're in my hair for my top knot. Um, but I also have some grips. I always get the blonde ones and you can hardly see them in my hair because I don't like the black ones in blonde hair because you can just see them. Even though you can see these, it's just... <coughs> <coughs> Sorry, I got a bit of a cough. Um it's just easier to use blonde ones that you can't properly see in your hair so the next thing that i have is my serum which i use to moisturize um it's the super drug naturally radiant two-in-one moisturizer and serum because my face is looking very dull and very red and very yucky more recently so i decided to pop some of this yummy smelling stuff on my face to see if it worked and it has so i'd rather like that um next thing i've got is my lip balm this is the born lippy in black currant slash passion berry i love this stuff so much i always put some underneath my nose so i can still smell it i know that sounds really weird but it's true and i do love it a lot um the next thing i have is another lip balm but i don't use this for my lips i use it for the dry areas on my face because it's so creamy so i use it on my scar here because it's all dried up and um i use it around my nose because i'm all scaly and yucky and dry over there and down here on my chin i'm very dry also so i just pop it on there as well and this is from fat base um same as my jumper that's why they match um obviously this is something that everyone has in their bathroom a toothbrush my own one's just blue and colgate um now i've just got some makeup -y bits in the bottom so this is just all the makeup that i bought here because i didn't want to bring like a whole 
bunch of it because there's no point because I'm, we're just going to be going down to the beach and everything's just going to be down here by the end of the day. So I just wear a few random little bits. So I curl my eyelashes first of all with my eyelash curlers and I hold it on for about three seconds. So you just do it like this. You clasp all your eyelashes together and you squeeze like scissors, let them go, and then your eyelashes are curled, so it's quite easy. And I just do that on normal eyelashes. Then I apply a coat of my favourite mascara at the moment, which is Collections Skyscraper. So volumising and lengthening, like, look at this. What is there not to love about that? It's just amazeballs. Um, I love it. Um, and mine's in black because I don't wear brown mascara. It just doesn't suit me, so I've just got some black. Um... Next thing I've got for my lower lashes is this big eyes stuff. Um, it goes like upper lashes and lower lashes. So the mascara comes in here and this is the upper lashes section. It's very lengthening, volumising. Then there's the end section where I've done the mascara and then the applicator. I really like this, it's very lengthening. Um, for my lips, I pop a pop on, you would have seen this in my last video as well, some Emiway Lux Whipped Velvet stuff for my lips. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry, I have a little bit of a tickle in my throat. Um, it's just the nude, you can't really see it, but it's beautiful on. Um, so yeah, I rather like that for everyday use. Um, and then the last piece of makeup that I bought was this Maybelline Dream Touch blush. It's like a cream. So if I open it, you only need a little bit of this stuff because honestly it goes so rosy so quickly. So look, I use like the tiniest amount and look how bright that has gone. I would normally blend it out more than that. I've just swatched it for you all. So that is all of the stuff that came in my wash bag. I'm just going to put this all away because I don't really want it hanging all over the show, to be perfectly honest. Shove everything back in the bag. Oh, goodness gracious. A lot. Ooh, there we go. So that's the bag. Now we just have some goodies on the tray to work through. So the first thing I have is my deodorant. This is the Right Guard Women Total Defense Pure Deodorant. I love the smell of this stuff. I love all um, Right Guard. I just love the smell of it. It's so fresh and so gorgeous. And I really, really like it. So I use that on my body. Um, next thing I've got is my Tangle Teaser because I do brush my hair in the morning. Um, I've fallen in love with Tangle Teasers and I just adore them now. So I've never used a brush since, a different brush since. So thumbs up if you like Tangle Teasers. Um, I rather like mine. The next thing I've got is my Clarisonic. This one is actually from a brand called Silvercrest because I couldn't afford to buy like a 125 um, pound exfoliating brush so I just picked mine up for I think 20 99 in Lidl um, I love Lidl's facial stuff it's really really nice um, this has lasted me a very very long time um, this like I said was 20 99 and um, you just get all different modes on it there's like fast, slow, vibrate, vibrate off, just normal and it's so soft on my face and I absolutely love it so um that's my Clarisonic and I bought it in this funky little doodah here because um, I didn't want the brush getting ruined during travel. So, did I just call it a doodah? I think I did. I like to call things doodahs. Here's a doodah. Anyway, back to the video. I'm just getting really carried away now. I'm very fidgety and I'm very eager now um, because the video is almost over and I'm just starting to get really uncomfy. So, uh, I need some better lighting right now. There we go. Um, sorry, there's just a lamp down there. Um, the next thing that I have is the Andrew Barton shampoo and conditioner because I wash my hair. I don't know about any of you, but I like to wash my hair. I washed it this morning, um, hence why it's up in a horrible bun because it was all frizzy. Um, 
but anyway this is just the andrew barton stuff it's for blonde hair i'm blonde hair if you couldn't see i have a lot of blonde hairs in my hair so um i like to keep my blonde hair i said blonde hair a lot because i'm turning brown um so to keep my blonde hair i use this stuff and it actually works uh, they were like five pound each but i was willing to pay the price for my hair so because i love my blonde hair it's just i like to keep it so that's why i bought this stuff and then the last thing that i've got which is obviously which is obviously something that we all have in our bathroom i think is a facial wash um i use the simple spotless skin because i'm getting all spotty i have one up here one up here one down here one on the nose and one over here and i like to keep them away because I don't think I'm the biggest fan of spots. I don't really think anyone is, to be perfectly honest, because they're so tempting to squeeze and pop. And um, I've done that before, and it's not. it doesn't end up very nice. So why just not start protecting them as soon as possible with this stuff, because it actually works. Apparently, you get results from day one. I got results from, like, day 12, I think it was. But still, it works. So, um never mind about that two week well not two week 10 day delay 10 day delay i like that um anyway this is my face wash it's by simple um so that was everything i keep in my bathroom i know i've been very weird in this video i'm just getting all bleh, because it's a very small space here i'm just sitting on a bed and then there's like my bed because i'm sleeping on the floor right now because it's only a one bedroom house um, so I'm sleeping on the floor, that's right next to me, then all the drawers are close to me, and then all the wardrobe is there, then there's another wardrobe, then there's some cupboards up there, and then there's a chair and a radiator and the curtains, and it's all, I'm just very, right now I'm just very squashed. Anyway, I'm going to stop this video right now, because you're probably getting really bothered and really not very happy with the style of this video. Anyway, I'm going to upload it, because... It's taken me 12 minutes of my time and I'm not wasting that. So, yeah, I'm just going to end this video right now. Give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. I presume I'm going to get more or less more thumbs down because this video isn't very good. But never mind. Make sure to subscribe to my channel because I only have three subscribers right now. But anyway, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you next time.